We usually prep our wings the day before, marinate them overnight. Fresh, everything is fresh here. Chicago style. Six wings, fried hard, salt and pepper, mild sauce with lemon pepper. The best chicken around. Wherever we go, everyone say, where you from? We say Chicago. Do you know about Harold's Chicken? Yes. It's a part of Chicago. Who doesn't go to Chicago and don't visit Harold? We've been operating in the city of Chicago for over 75 years. My dad was a young black man that came from the South with a dream, and he worked hard during the time that African Americans wasn't capable of obtaining any businesses or funding, and his hard work paid off. My dad believed in word of mouth, so you don't see any commercials, none of that. We are a family-owned business. It's not corporate-owned, it's family-owned. Since I've held this position, presentation is important to me. I wanted to see the chicken with the wings out presented a little bit different, yeah. so the, the food would be, it would look different. Mm -hmm. So when you get a, get a chance to sit down and look at it, you're like, oh, this looks too good to eat. This is uh, some of the mild sauce right here. This is our gallon. When I was a kid, the mild sauce was only ketchup and hot sauce. And as time went on, um, we started doing the barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. So we had an idea to mix um, hot sauce and some things together, and we created the mouth sauce. We have market in, what, seven other states? Eight. And so we have 40-some more to go. So that, that is our goal. And when my dad started, it was for the small man to get ahead. It was for them to learn about business, entrepreneurship, and we're still doing it to this day. We're still doing the community network. We're still employing people. So we want to continue to do that as a national brand, just to see my father's name. He's no longer here. He's been gone 36 years. So it's keeping a part of him. It's just keeping him here. We are approaching 75 years and we're hoping that it will just last throughout the grandkids, great-grandkids, great-great-great-grandkids. Whenever I passed by Harold's, you know, I had contemplating um, a few times of selling. And what changed my mind was, I'd rather say, there is my dad, than there goes my dad. That's keeping a part of my dad alive.